apple cider vinegar, I think, is something that's been around for, I think, quite a while in the wellness space. I myself, as a registered nutritionist, encounter it probably every week, if I'm being honest, in terms of the amount of people that come in having heard claims about weight loss, about insulin sensitivity. And there is a new study that came out in 2024. So it's a randomized control trial. It's got good data behind it, but we still need, in my opinion, a larger sample size when it comes to weight loss and the claims that apple cider vinegar has around it. It's almost got what I call a health halo impact. A health halo food is what we tend to call in the nutrition industry an item that is perceived as superior to others. So you probably heard the term a while ago, superfoods. For once it was protein, you know, protein was on every single packet on even chocolate bars, and therefore people seem to think it's better for their health. I feel like apple cider vinegar is one of those items now that people kind of have an idea that it's associated or linked to health benefits. Therefore, they are more likely to consume it for that reason. The mechanisms are still not fully understood. We've got rodent trials, we have a very small amount of human trials, and in fact, the most recent study was conducted on overweight people and obese individuals. There's also a confusion around links with diabetes, so it may potentially be beneficial for type two diabetes, but that's a very different issue for people with type one, which is autoimmune. I would honestly say for people that are going to suddenly take a shot of apple cider vinegar, please consult with your healthcare professional and do it in the right way because it can cause all sorts of digestive discomfort if you haven't diluted it to the correct ratio. For some people it can flare up digestive systems that are already underlying. We're looking at very on the edge science I would say, something that isn't quite robust enough for me to say on a public health level everyone should be taking apple cider vinegar.